So to get started out with creating this little bush, all you have to do is enable the extra mesh add-on, and then you can add yourself a single vertice. Then with that, add a skin modifier to it, and then a subsurf modifier right afterwards. This will let you extrude the geometry out, and it'll work really nicely. But before we get started, I like to add a cube, which is about six feet tall, so we have a human scale reference, so we don't work outside of scale. Then to manipulate it, just extrude the vertices around. It'll create the geometry around the vertices like this. And you can use Control A to scale how big you want each mesh block to be. What I like to do is enable proportional editing and set it to linear and connected only. Then I'll select the vertices at the end of each branch and Control A to scale it down and it'll get smaller as it gets to the center. Then I like to go in and clean everything up just a little bit using Control A and proportional editing. And then once you've done that, you can add yourself an icosphere and use, once again, proportional editing to give yourself the little leaf bunches. And I like to scale them differently and rotate them around to give them some variety. And this is just a really easy way to do things. And then I like go do one last pass and go over the branches once again to touch everything up. And once you've done that, all you have to do is add your materials. But first, I like to parent the leaves to the branch. So all you have to do is select all the leaves and select the trunk and press Control P and parent. Then you can duplicate everything and create uh, alternate versions if you like. Then for the green, I'll go ahead and put the hex values I used on the screen now. And then same for the brown. And after you've done that, just create some extra duplicates and you've got yourself some bushes. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed.